What's up guys, today we're gonna to be opening up some really awesome old school packs. We have reprints, four of them. Then we have four 2003 packs and four 2002 with three of them being first edition. This is gonna be huge. This is gonna be awesome. Hopefully we can pull some really cool stuff. But before we get started, the giveaway for this video, I'll be giving away these three cards. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed. Let me know what your favorite pack is here. What do you wanna see? How many foils are we going to pull? Let me know in the comments. I'm pretty excited. Let's go ahead and hop into this. We have 12 packs. 12 chances. So we have reprints here. We opened a lot of reprints. We have Pharaoh's Servant. You guys know what happens when we open Pharaoh's Servant. There's three packs here. Will we pull a Jinzo out of three packs? I'm going to say no. But last time I said no, you saw what happened. Deep Sea Warrior. Here we go. Numinous Healer. And a for Forced Requisition. So nothing in the first pack. Slow start, but we have 11 packs. If we're going to go with duds, let's do it on the reprint packs. Let's have some big packs on the first edition packs. Or even the 2003 unlimited packs. We have Dark Zebra. Eternal Rest. Spear Cretan. Heo Zanru. All right, Kotodama. That's okay. 0 for 2. Still 10 to go. Slow start. But we're, it's not about how you start, it's about how you finish. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Okay, yeah, I'm just kidding. Guardian of the Labyrinth, what do we want? Summon Skull, we could pull another Gate Guardian. If you guys didn't see when we pulled that the other day, check out that video. That was absolutely insane. Jinzo number seven. Ooh, a Twin-Headed Thunder Dragon. We've got a super rare, where are my sleeves? We've got a super rare Twin-Headed Thunder Dragon right there. Metal Raiders, our first foil of the video. That is not bad. The rest of the pack, we got a white magical hat. King of Yami Makai with that 1530 defense. Hibukime, Bottom Dweller, and Pumpkin. That's a pretty cool card, or a pretty cool pack right there. A lot of cool cards. All right. It's going well. We have we are one out of three. Looks like we are doing not too bad. Can we end it with a foil on the reprint packs? Tyhone, Skull Servant. Mountain. All right, just a mountain. Dragon is the Wicked Knight. In those reprint packs, the foil would have been before the rare because you get both a foil and a rare. But in these other eight packs, it will not be like that. So now we've opened all the reprint packs. We pulled one foil. That's not bad. So if we get one foil out of each set of four here, that would actually not be too terrible. Hopefully we can get an ultra rare at some point, maybe even a secret rare. Let's start off with Pharaoh's Servant 2003. Supposedly these came out of a 10, so I think they would be 2003 packs. And you can also tell by this top part here. Wow, the thing's like kind of messed up. Let's see what we can get. We have a Regulation of the Tribe. Skull Mariner. Cold Wave. Pretty crazy card. Gamble. Okay, we're gambling right now, opening these packs. Here we go. Morphing Jar number two. We got a Science Soldier, Driving Wind, Harpy's Brother, and Reign of Mercy. All right, nothing in the first pack from Pharaoh's Servant, but that's okay. Oh, actually, let's see. Are they? Yeah, they're Spell Magic cards. So they're definitely 2003 10s. A lot of people think that if it says Spell and it's from and it's MRL like this, let me show you guys. If it says, uh, oh wait. Sorry, we can't do it on this. We gotta do it on Magic Ruler. I'll show you guys on Magic Ruler. But still, um, since it came out of a 2003 pack and it says spell, that's normal. But these are what people think is an error. So if we get to a spell card, I'll show you guys out of this one. Magic Ruler. It says Magic Ruler on the pack. So naturally, you think it's a magic card, stuff like that. Let's go. Let's see what's in here. Hopefully, we can get a foil and a spell card. So, you got, so I can show you guys. Jig and Bakudin. Flash Assailant. Okay, here we go. See, this is an MRL spell card. A lot of people think this is an error. This is not an error. Every 2003 pack, so like it's from 2002-10, it's going to say this. It's not an error. It's just kind of kind of rare to see. A Giant Germ. We got Performance of the Sword. Magical Labyrinth. See, spell card. MRL. Every single one from a 2003 pack is going to look... 2003-10 pack is going to look like that. All right, so we are 0 for 2 on the 2003 packs, but last time we pulled the Twin Out of Thunder Dragons in the reprints and Metal Raiders. So will Metal Raiders be the one to save us here? I'd be okay if we did that. If we pulled out of Metal Raiders and then the first edition Metal Raiders, that'd be cool. Mushroom Man, we got a Blast Juggler. Rock Ogre Grotto, the centering is terrible on these. Labyrinth Tank. Oh, oh, Magician of Faith, okay. So just a rare, but it was probably the best rare in the set. You guys can let me know if you disagree with that, but Magician of Faith, definitely a good one to get. 
We got Bistro Butcher, Doma, the Angel of Silence, Little Swords and Veil, and Block Attack. Come on, we need something big. We have five more packs. They're all pretty huge. This one is a 2003 LLB booster pack. We did pull. Yeah. Okay. We did pull the Blue Eyes White Dragon out of the last pack when we opened those uh, those tins out of these 2003. So maybe we can get that luck again. Basic Insect. Ray and Timpatura. Dragon Treasure. Okay, hit the like button for luck, guys. We need a foil. We need something big. Oh! <laughs> Dark Magician! Oh, and that pack opened kind of weird, so I'm like, oh no, are these resealed? But, uh, no, they're definitely not. Dark Magician, 2003. That centering is pretty bad, so I don't think this one is um, PSA 10 worthy, but we're not complaining. We got a Dark Magician from a 2003 10, so now we have a 2003 Blue Eyes and a 2003 Dark Magician. That's a huge pull. Imagine if this was out of this pack. Actually, it wouldn't be that much different, but if it was like Metal Raiders and we pull like Summon Skull, yeah, if that happens, we're losing it. Dark Magician, that is amazing. Oh my goodness. Woo, I was like, please don't pull nothing in this video. We didn't, we pulled something. Skull Servant, Green Phantom King, he taught me giant and follow in. That is now like, I think that's the third old Dark Magician I pulled. I pulled two out of this, out of the original 2002 pack. That's the first 2003 Dark Magician I've pulled though. That is a great pull. That is awesome. Okay, now we're into the huge packs. Whew, oh my goodness. Should we start with the unlimited LOB? I don't know. It just feels wrong starting with LOB. Let's just start with Pharaoh's Servant. This is first edition, guys. I don't know if it's uh, retail code or not. Um, but, yeah, if it's if it's retail, or if it's not retail, we can get Jinzo. If it is retail, we could still get Imperial Order, which would be cool. You can also get, um, let's just mention it again. Never pulled a Buster Blader. Come on. <laughs> we got a Earthshaker, Mr. Volcano. Time Seal. Oh, wow. Check that out. That is super cool. Look at the centering on these. Oh, my goodness. It's horrible. Science Soldier. Okay. This is where it'd be. This is where our luck could come through. I have a... Oh, man. I'm scared. I'm scared. Red Moon Baby always comes out of these. Bubonic Vermin. There you go. I know one of y'all loves Bonnie Furman, so. Seven completed, Enchanted Javelin, and Overdrive. First edition Pharaoh's Servant, we did not get Jinzo, guys. I'm just saying, we didn't get Jinzo. We had a video where we didn't get Jinzo, so we got first edition. I'm gonna sleeve that up just because it's uh, first edition cards. All right, three more packs. Oh my goodness. Magic Ruler, what? Blue Eyes Toon Dragon, Serpent Night Dragon. It could be either one of those. Um, it just depends on what the code is. We've got uh, Relinquish. That could be big. Man, imagine a Relinquish. That'd be super cool. Anything like us. If we get an Ultra Rare, we're hyped. Chain Energy. Oh, I hate that card now. After that duel with Gezi, you guys can look at that. That was an insane. That was insane. High Tide Gyujin. The Boar Soldier. The Hamburger Recipe. Will we get the Hungry Burger? That is the main goal here. Hungry Burger. UFO Turtle. Okay, Koto Dama. Tober we did it again. Hungry Burger and Hamburger Recipe in the same pack. The Legendary. That almost seems grade worthy. I feel like we should grade that. That is pretty awesome. Okay, we're down to the last two packs. We got first edition of Mardi. Please, come on. Please pull a foil. Anything, even super rares I would take out of first edition MRD. Oh my gosh. Can we pull a foil, please? Just for the for the channel, for the viewers. Come on. Can we pull something? Oh my goodness. If we pull a summon skull, I will cry on camera. Illusionist Faceless Mage. Cybersaurus, come on. Gate Guardian? Thousand Dragon? Destroyer Golem. These are first edition. Come on. Jellyfish. Okay. Whew. I'm nervous. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god. We got an ultra rare. Horn of Heaven. The meme has materialized in the form of a horn of heaven. Oh my goodness. The worst ultra rare. But guess what? I meme on this thing. This is going to be. You guys are going to love this. But I don't care. This is an ultra rare from a Metal Raiders loose pack. Sold to me by one of you guys. So thank you again for selling me these packs. That card is actually 
It's winning me over a little bit right now. This car looks really nice. I don't know. It, it looks like a... The, the Horn of Heaven looks like a bugle. You know those, those little chip things? You can eat. They're shaped like this, but they don't have wings, obviously. It looks like a flying bugle. Horn of Heaven. <laughs> what a meme. That is so awesome. Tainted Wisdom. I can't believe we got an Ultra Rare from a Loose Metal Raiders pack. That is so much fun. You guys are going to have a field day with that. Horn of Heaven. Oh my goodness. Unreal. Okay, so that's pretty exciting. Final pack we have Blue Eyes White Dragon Unlimited. If this was first dead, it would be going crazy, but we already pulled Dark Magician, so what can we even ask for at this point? Wow. What an opening. What an o I said three foils. We got three, so I guess I'm happy at this point. These are Magic Card LOB. Here we go. Red Medicine. Whew, Terror of the Terrible. Kurama. Dark gray. This is it. This is the big boy. This could be blue eyes. Hit the like button for luck. Can we do last pack magic? Blue eyes white dragon again. <sighs> oh, mystical elf. Okay, super rare. This is great. We're taking this all day. I pull mystical elf. Like every LOB opening. We are taking that though. Super rare. Oh my goodness. What an opening. Wow. This is amazing. Let's go over what we got, guys. Wow, from 12 packs, we got a Magician of Faith, rare. We got a Twin of Thunder Dragon reprint. Mystical Elf from the original 2002 pack. It does have that slight foil shift that a lot of original 2002s have. We got a Dark Magician from a 2003 pack. And we got the legendary first edition Horn of Heaven. At least we didn't get it out of the booster box. <laughs> that is absolutely crazy. Yeah, so if you want to check out my Metal Raiders booster box, check that out. That is so much. That is so cool. I'm hyped about this opening. Yeah, this was really awesome. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this awesomeness. And we have more stuff coming up for 50,000. I'm going to be opening up uh, something pretty awesome, but I don't want to reveal it until I have it in hand. It's going to be a pretty awesome opening. I also have a huge, massive opening. That'll probably be done in February. So keep an eye out for that. It's going to be really cool. And that's it for this video. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh! Yes. Oh. Elemental Hero, Dark Bright. Boom! Oh! <laughs>